What's up, bros? Adventure Bro here, back at it again for another episode of the Adventure Bro Show. And today, we are somewhere that we've never been before. But I just scoped out the new spot and it looks very promising. It was a tip by one of the followers, one of my subscribers. Thanks for the tip. And I think we're gonna get on them today. Let's go. All right, bro. Here we are at the spillway. It is cold as I don't know what. The wind is blowing at about 20 miles per hour. And we're still about to fish. We're still about to get on it. So here we go, guys. This is where the water is coming in from the reservoir and it meets the bay. So right now we've got the wind coming in this way. That's pushing that water on top here, but we've also got this current from the spillway coming in this way. So what that does, it makes a mixture of the two waters right behind us. And that churns up the bait fish, it aerates the water, and it brings your predatory fish in here. So that's what we're going to be hoping for. We're looking for reds, flounder, maybe some trout out in here right in this area so let's get on them for our first baits we're just gonna be throwing shrimp on a hook shrimp on a hook sponsored by shrimp on a barbie this is just to see what's actually out here you can always get a good lay of the land if you throw some shrimp out and see what bites And for our next debate, we are going to be throwing the good old trusty gulp on a special jig head. All right, that's it right there, bros. And then we're going to be working this area right here, right in between the rocks in this channel. Nothing on that just yet, bros. Good God, it's cold though. All right, let's check this. I know nothing's on it, but hey. And it doesn't look like anything even. Well, I know something did bite it. Let's see if we can get another one to bite it. I'm gonna put it right there where all this water's mixing, right here. Don't do that. Good God Almighty. Good God Almighty, it's cold. Fish really don't like this guy. I don't know why. Check this out. 
probably don't have anything on it because it would have pulled if it was. And there is not a nil, not a nibble throwing it under the bridge. All right, bros. I'm about to take a break, but before I do, I want to share with you guys why I think the fish are not biting right now. Number one, it's cold as hell. Number two, there's a phenomenon going on right now in our area that I've seen called the draining of the bay. And you can see it over there. You can see the water line and then you can see where the water used to be. So let's just take a look at it right here. All right. The water is about a foot and a half lower than it normally is. So I think that has caused the fish to move into different areas. I mean, you can even see it a lot better over here where it seems that the water is very, very low. I mean, that's the normal water line up there. You usually can't walk down on that and look at where the water is now. So check that out. Yeah, so I'm freezing. I haven't gotten a single bite. I'm about to go sit in my truck and take a break, warm up, and then go to these docks that are over there and fish a little bit more. So stay tuned and I'll see you in a bit. I just finished thawing out and here we go we're gonna get back out there and try and catch something let's make it happen so it's a little bit more promising bros not gonna lie to you looks a little bit more promising just a little bit post a skunk video but hey it is what it is at least I'm fishing instead of wishing <laughs> thank you guys for tuning in be sure to like comment share and subscribe and I will be back to seek revenge on this spot which is gonna be my first skunk What's up, man? All right. Uh, you got a brake light out on your driver's side. Yeah, it's only when I press on the brake. Well, it's supposed to come on when you press on. I know, right? It's very weird. The whole light will go out. I think the wiring's bad on it, so I need to check that out. Might be a bad connection. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I just thought I'd tell you. I appreciate it, man. Right. If you needed a jump, you should have let me know. No, I ain't gonna interrupt a man's fishing. I appreciate that. That's a good man. Have a Christmas. All right, you too. There's some good people out here in this world, man. Real good people. Oh my goodness, man. It's cold. 
and I don't like the cold. I need to find some 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 gloves that I can still fish with. But guys, bros, couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Couldn't catch a fish today. It's not an experience that I want to wish on my worst enemy. I wouldn't even wish that experience on myself. I usually am catching fish. At least something, you know, a catfish, a croaker, a whiting, something, something. But nothing even bit on shrimp today. And that is incredible. So guys, I believe that this cold front that's pushed in, these winds and the changing tides with the full moon earlier this week, causing the draining of the bays, I believe all of those things played a factor into why we couldn't get a single bite today. But don't worry, because we're going to get on them the next day we go out, which is probably going to be tomorrow. So thanks for tuning in. Once again, if you're new to the channel, appreciate if you would just hit that little button at the bottom to subscribe. If you've been in the channel before and you like the content, I appreciate the support. This is a passion of mine. This isn't something that I just picked up and started doing. Now I've been fishing my whole life, man. And I just wanted to be able to bring my experiences, my adventures to you guys because I'm always doing something crazy or something crazy always happens to me when I'm out here. So, hey, why not get it on film? If it's not on film, it didn't happen. Well, this happened today and I got skunked.